In attendance to this event was Correctional Services Commissioner Stephen Pokanis, Deputy Commissioner Corporate Affairs Michael Mosiri, and President of Correctional Services Employees Association Daniel Mullen, with the Life Insurance Corporation CEO Dipayande and his team. According to CEO Dipayande, this three-year agreement offers correctional services officers to have access to insurance products and services. All CIS officers, whether it is an accidental death or a natural death, are covered up to 45,000 kina worth of life benefits. For medical benefit, you now have coverage all around the country, no matter where you are going. So if you go to private, uh, med uh, private medical clinics, you can pay your bills and reimburse 80% through, uh, through the uh, uh, CIS HR office. This also benefits lives of thousands of families across the country. There, there is death coverage for, for uh, members of for the spouse as well. There's funeral coverage, 5,000 kina. So you, not, it's not only just for your members. You declare your spouse. Your spouse is also covered in case of death of 5,000 kina. President of Correctional Services Employees Association, Daniel Mullen, highlighted the proponents of this partnership. So that's the type of uh, exposure our members are, you know, the risk that our members are exposed to. So with this insurance cover, it gives confidence back to our members. Uh, like every time we go to national call up, we are not insured. After their statements, formalities took place. Commissioner Pokanis emphasized that the agreement provides full benefits. And when I look at the cover, the draft that was given to me, I saw that, you know, uh, in my um, experience, limited experience reading other covers for uh, other organizations, I, I saw that what we have here for correctional services has opened um, new doors that we, I did not see in other um, insurance covers. For instance, um, people um, dying from communicable uh, diseases like HIV AIDS. Grace Papiali, National MTV News.